There's one guy who had the idea for this, who's been helped by all of you in this room, and it's a pleasure for me to be here tonight. I, I look up to this guy a lot, his humility and his courage to do what he's meant to do really is why we're all here. Tonight he is the founder and the main man of Needs Beyond Medicine, Philip Brown. So first of all, I just want to thank everybody for coming out tonight uh, to this event. And I just wanted to give one last round of applause to our speakers and also our survivors that are here as well. So this year marks our eighth year doing this uh, with the help of Chad Hurst. He's the photographer. That, did all these amazing and beautiful pictures he does each year for us. And uh, without it, obviously, this wouldn't happen. And without all the survivors that are willing to let us take their photo and then have them share their most experiences about surviving and helping the community seeing that once you're diagnosed with cancer, there is a life after cancer. There's things that you can still do after cancer. There's a life to still be lived in your speed bumps. Uh, just tonight, I would like to thank so much for all of our sponsors and all the people that donated all the items for the silent auction and also the raffle. Hopefully, everyone's at least been around once to look at it and put in some bids. So, uh, I'd also like to thank especially the Sorensen Legacy Foundation. They're actually our main presenting sponsor, and this is the third year they've pre uh, been our sponsor. All these beautiful pictures uh, are donated by a company called Ferrari Color. They've uh, been doing the pictures for us the last seven years and they turn out amazing and show all of the details and everything. In June of this year, Needs Beyond Medicine celebrated their 10th year anniversary. Uh, Obviously, we've had some ups and downs with any business. We've had better years and great years, and hopefully, you know, 2016 was a good year, and hopefully 2017 is a better year. Um, through October of this year, we've helped over 1,000 cancer patients through our relief program. Uh, what the relief program is, is it's an, a program to help cancer patients going through treatment to help cover non-medical costs. So all the money raised here tonight goes into that program. Uh, also, what we do is we do educational seminars throughout the state on signs and symptoms of cancer. Uh, we partner a lot with the colleges and universities just to speak on campus about early signs and symptoms because through our relief program, we're seeing more and more people are being diagnosed with later stages of cancer at a younger age. I want to thank so much my board of directors and without their help, this event wouldn't be possible for them. Finding the auction items and just finding even donors for the monetary side just to help us put this event on. Um, I want to send a special thank you as well to Terry Burden for being the MC tonight. Most of all, I want to thank everybody for being here and supporting us throughout the, I see a lot of familiar faces I've seen throughout the years. So I want to send a special thank you as well to my, my family, my friends that support me and throughout the years, obviously this is a full-time job and then some, so I want to thank them very much and I also want to thank Larissa Desaw for helping us put together all the baskets as well for tonight's event. I want to lastly just say thank you. I'm hopeful for next year's event to be bigger and better, and I hope 
how many people liked it here at the falls too if you have been to events before so i think we'll we'll try to come back next year for a bigger and better year and hopefully this is a successful year but thank you again so much for the speakers i can't thank you enough especially for kyle he actually did it last minute for us and thanks for speaking for us and Dr. Beck and Dr. Sweetenham and all the other speakers and also just everyone for being here. Obviously we wouldn't be, have a successful year if people weren't here. It's an amazing turnout and we're thrilled to have you guys here. And thank you guys again so very much and here's to 2017.